actually killed me mentally. I don't I don't know what I can do. All I can do is all I can do is watch the next awesome group of content. Wait, it's gonna just be even fucking wilder, actually. Hold on. This is even wilder. Ugh. Uh, boys, you ready? My psycho mom got me pregnant at 13. Actually happened story. My story animated. Is ready? This, uh, this hurts. Let's watch it, dude. My name is Emily. I am 13 years old. And this is a story about how my baby came to be. That's right. I have a... Shouldn't even be laughing at it. This is, um... I, I just, if you ever hear those words... Okay, like, if you ever hear these first, like, let me, let me repeat. Hello there, my name is Emily. I am 13 years old, and this is a story about how my baby can be. If you ever hear those words, give these guys a call. They'll, um, leave it to them. That's right, I have a son. How is this, like, seven, wow, this is, like, mega liked. What the fuck? And I'm only 13. It's as uncomfortable a story as it sounds, but I feel the need to share it. No, I did not plan to have a kid this early, and I never even was with another guy. I know this sounds confusing, so let me start with my mother. I'm pretty sure she's transformed from the sweet woman to the actual devil incarnate. My parents first met each other when they were only six months old. And that's right, six months. What?! Your parents first met at six months? I, uh... There's a new 2H32 video? What's 2H32? Your streams are legendary, but I usually miss them. I don't have a schedule. I just get really high. Months. They were only babies, and their parents were actually really close friends. They'd often come and go from each other's houses, or stay the night. They would always lay the two babies down in the same crib, and they'd always be around each other. They played together. They took their first stumbling steps in the same house. They were always together. They knew- So they're fucking basically siblings that got married later on. That's- This is a little fucking- This fucked up. This is like- This is like- the, the art style does not match the actual fucking story here real quick. Where's the share your story? This is- This is a lot- Wait, what else do they do? I caught my mom with my boyfriend. Okay, that's a little lighthearted. Let's go see that. Hi, my name is Sarah, and I don't know what to do. My mama and my boyfriend have a dirty secret. Oh, they're fucking. You caught them fucking. I'm completely freaking out, and I have to tell my story to someone. I'm in dire need of some advice. She's about to, like, laugh. I'm 19, but still live at home with my mom. Okay. College is very expensive, and I saved a lot of money by not moving out yet. Went close to I love that. Good the job. Goes way beyond my budget, love you. Love you too, Jack. Not gonna so lie, crappy. I think uh, one of my favorite is the Sanders one. one. That one. Really cool <laughs> that was a good video. The feeling you get when you go fast forward past the cringe, though, you can't fast forward. Time, and she always gave the best advice when it came to my romantic life. Whenever I had guy problems, I didn't go to my friends. I went to my mom. My mom Dad knew how to keep them boys in check. Their relationship never really worked. They constantly bickered. Dad still takes care of me, and I love him to bits, but he can't stand my mom. So, they barely see each other nowadays. Okay. At first, when are we gonna get to the fucking no problems getting dates. She's a really beautiful woman, so that makes Let's sense. just get to the part where, like, However, they catch mom and them. Lately, men her age seem to be uh, more interested in younger girls. Alright, let's go over here. My boyfriend was cheating on me with my mom. Yo, the boyfriend's a mega Chad. Look at the fucking boyfriend. He's just like, like mom and daughter are having like this fucking crisis. And he's just like, so when am I going to fuck that mom again? 
we're gonna fuck that milf pussy dog. <laughs> like, the, like the, the art style doesn't make any sense. Mom tried to raise it with me. <laughs> My parents, me sweet home this. Alabama. Yeah. I, told them I, didn't I don't like open BSD as a, a, a desktop OS. Even doesn't really fit me for me. It's a good OS, just not a desktop daily driver. Well, I don't think I'll ever be able to trust him again. As oh god, mom, dude. He was about to fuck my mom. I don't think I can trust him around my mom. I don't think I can trust him. We're gonna have to spend Mother's Day without the boyfriend. I love her. After all, she was the one who raised me. But what she did was too messed up. Yeah, she fucked my man. That's my know. dick. Sweet home Alabama. <laughs> that's all I'm hearing from this shit. What is this? How I survived the falling elevator? Okay, that's cool. I got pregnant with no private part. Hi, my name is Sophie, and I'd like to tell you the craziest thing that ever happened in my life. Even though I'm just 16 and don't have any private parts, I haven't seen 2B32. Parts, is that I an art channel? Got you gotta check that out. And the way it happened was so dramatic that it took a long time to convince the father of the baby I wasn't lying. Let me tell you all about how it happened. That I'm fucked just the Virgin Mary 2.0. Believable. Cool. Fill up, because it's a wild ride. So let me begin by telling you that until I entered high school, I didn't even know I wasn't normal. I was the only child of a rather young couple, and they didn't deal with my condition well. Mom and dad were Thoughts still on in Unsolved Mysteries? I haven't seen it. I've been meaning to watch it on Netflix. To get married. It ended up turning really well, and they really loved each other. But in the beginning, it was sort of a disaster. Mom admitted to me, years later, she didn't feel ready to be a mother, and that she was freaking out about it. So you imagine? That's like the nicest way of saying, listen, I don't want to say the Belle Delphine condom broke, but sweetie, come over here. Come over here. Come over here, sweetie. The condom broke. I'm not saying that you're an accident. God sent you to our house. Okay? Little unexpected, but he sent you here, and we love you the same. That's what mom's about to fucking say. <laughs> she really said, I have no pussy. <laughs> what the fuck, dude? Uh, play Dinoblox? <laughs> the fuck is Dinoblox? Thank you, Nibiv Phantom, for the 20 bucks, dude. Thoughts on Unsolved Mysteries. I do like that show. I do actually really like that show. So she might not have gone to as many... Well, I like the old one. I didn't see the new, new shit from Netflix. Is the new, is the new stuff... Actually, I've heard so many good news. I think I'll watch that as I'm rebuilding my system. Which sounds as she should have. That's how... On the day of I'm playing birth, Smash, watching my the stream. For the very first time I want to play Smash again. My brother's been like fucking on the events. grind. He's also on Monster Hunter, so I want to do it. My... It's a Roblox prototype? Bullshit. Dinoblox? I probably can't play it underneath Linux. Can I? Dinoblox? Now hold on, boys. Oh shit, dude. Oh shit. What the fuck is this? That's a little too. That's a little too bright and colorful. Oh, that looks good. I might fuck with that. I might fuck with it. You never know. My mom and dad were. These videos are sure, actual cancer. Crazy. What is this? I was forced to get pregnant and give birth. In my family, we did what we were told. My parents are. Been simping for you since you did. I'm scared, bro. That is fucking long time. That is my. It's like Birds that was that was un that was shaved mood. Never an option. Th dude, these are these are actually fucking weird stories. Look at this one. I w what J I woke up from a coma, in jail and pregnant. What the fuck? What the fuck, dude? Dude, I'm falling down a rabbit hole that I don't want to go to. This is fucking weird. Story time. YouTube is insane. Okay. Okay, it's just, story time YouTube is clinically fucking insane. Can we just say that? I can't just watch more than 20% of the... I cannot watch those videos, period. They fucking physically hurt me. Roblox does not work. I can't play Roblox. I can't even fire up a... Guys, this is what my fucking computer is right now. I can't access VMs. You want to know why? Because permissions are totally broken. I can't even sudo properly. I have to reset my Linux install because I'm a fucking idiot. I'm an actual dumbass. 
my rich boyfriend is a girl. I, mean, I don't know. This sounds kind of hot, though, doesn't it? I spent the night at Kylie Jenner's house. I saw everything. All right. Wow, the animation is a million times better. Do you have an idol who you'd be ready to do something crazy for? More than anyone, I love Kylie Jenner. Man, 15 seconds in, and how how could you say everything wrong at the same time? You know, look, I'm not I'm not saying I'm not saying that <laughs> Do you ever have a fan? Do you ever have an idol? Do you ever have somebody you look up to like I I I, I would I would I would I would run over someone for Kylie Jenner, dude. Not gonna lie. From morning till night, I leaf through her Instagram pics and watch Keeping Up with the Kardashians. I e even have a collection of magazines which interviewed or mentioned her and her beauty products. If this seems a little ridiculous or no, it seems pretty fucking mental to me. Strange to you, then you'll be completely blown away by my story. I don't know how not to like Kylie. Most of my colleagues, and even my friends, laugh at me because of it. None of them got upset when she started dating the rapper Tyga. And none of them were as overjoyed as I was when they broke up. Were they blind? To be honest, I didn't even care that much about their jokes. Kylie is the coolest girl in the world, and I just knew one day that we would meet i would pay a hundred thousand dollars to sit with kylie jenner and watch this video with her this is fucking weird this is really fucking scary <laughs> like so far in the minute that i've known this character he sounds like a fucking serial killer you know these stories are all fake oh i know they're fake 100 percent, but like they're fucking weird <laughs> haram fan thank you you're awesome man no you're awesome brother jesus this is great. I thought about it and came to the realization to get Kylie's attention, I needed to get on the Forbes top 100 list or walk on the red carpet. Yo, if that shit is in motivation right there. Look, man, there's only one way to get my true girl Kylie. And that's if I somehow end up on Forbes, like fucking multi-billionaire. This is like the story of like, fucking the the simp the simp the simply or some shit right like if you had that like the billionaire man that literally became rich and successful to get in someone's pants that's like above and beyond i gotta god bless dude it's sad because there are people who actually praise her i mean i don't know i mean i, I don't know anything about kylie jenner i have no idea i don't let me tell you something about the jenners and shit like that and the kardashians I don't fucking care, okay? The only reason I know anything about the Kardashians is, like, uh, the O.J. Simpson case. So I know about the dad, right? But, like, the family I don't have any idea about. Like, I I, 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 I remember my family in the States. They watched Keeping Up with the Kardashians and stuff, right? They were, like, the New York family I had, which is fine. It's whatever. But I felt like a fucking dumbass socially when I walked, when I walked to their house. When I, like, when I was there... And I saw them watching it, and I didn't have an idea who the Kardashians were. Like, when I watched it, I was like, I asked the question. I'm like, why? what's up with keeping up with the Kardashians? Why do we watch it? What's it about? What's the story of it? Like, why are we watching the show? And, like, they didn't have an answer. It's just, like, they wanted to see all of it. And I was like, okay, cool. So I don't have any, like, thing to get. Like, I don't fucking care, you know? It's just, um... It's also the same thing with celebrities. Like, I don't understand shit like celebrity worship. Like, what the fuck is celebrity worship? Like, I just don't get it. Like, trying to, like, worship someone else when you should really just fucking give more of a shit about yourself, right? They don't get me wrong. Like, I fuck with certain celebrities. I like them. But I don't, like, live vicariously or anything. I think that's fucking weird. But, uh, yeah. I don't know. Pe pe people are fucking, dude. People are fucking some type of weird, dude. That, that is what it is.